G'day, welcome to Partaker's Christmas 2018 podcast series. Tuesday, Merry Christmas at Partaker's. We pray that you have an amazingly blessed day as we remember throughout the world the birth of Jesus, the most amazing man. Today, a Christmas sermon of St. Gregory of Nazianzus of the 4th century. Christ is born, glorify him. Christ from heaven, go out to meet him. Christ on earth, be exalted, sing to the Lord all the whole earth, and that I may join both in one word, let the heavens rejoice, and let the earth be glad, for him who is of heaven and then of earth. Christ in the flesh, rejoice with trembling and with joy, with trembling because of your sins, with joy because of your hope. Again, the darkness is passed again, light is made again. Egypt is punished with darkness, and again Israel is enlightened by a pillar. The people who sat in the darkness of ignorance, let them see the great light full of knowledge. Old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. The letter gives way. The spirit comes to the front. The shadows flee away. The truth comes in on them. Melchizedek is concluded. He who was without mother becomes without father, without mother of his former state, without father of his second. The laws of nature are upset. The world above must be filled. Christ commands it. Let us not set ourselves against him. Oh, clap your hands together, all you people, because unto us a child is born and a son given unto us, whose government is upon his shoulder. For with the cross it is raised up, and his name is called the Angel of the Great Council of the Father. Let John cry, Prepare the way of the Lord. I too will cry the power of this day. He who is not carnal is incarnate. The Son of God becomes the Son of Man. Jesus Christ the same yesterday and today and forever. Let the Jews be offended. Let the Greeks deride. Let heretics talk until their tongues ache. Then they shall believe when they see him ascending into heaven, and if not then, yet when they see him coming out of heaven and sitting as judge. This is our present festival, Christmas, the Christ Mass. It is this which we are celebrating today, the coming of God to man, that we might go forth, or rather, for this is the more proper expression, that we might go back to God, that putting off of the old man, we might put on the new, and that as we died in Adam, so we might live in Christ, being born with Christ, and crucified with him, buried with him, and rising with him. For I must undergo the beautiful conversion, and as the painful succeeded the more blissful, so must the more blissful come out of the painful. For where sin abounded, grace did much more abound. And if a taste condemned us, how much more does the passion of the Christ justify us? Therefore let us keep the feast, this Christmas, not after the manner of a heathen festival, but after a godly sort, not after the way of the world, but in a fashion above and beyond the world, not as our own, but as belonging to him who is ours, or rather as our masters, not as of weakness, but as of healing, not as of creation, but of re-creation. Amen. Thanks for joining us at Partakers. Come back every day to www.partakers.co.uk where there is a podcast uploaded daily
to help empower you as a Christian in the 21st century. See you later.